Hello, 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 it's good to see you, look who's here, look who's here with us, look who's here visiting, he's taking a snooze, so, so we can't, we can't be too loud, cause we can't, we can't be too loud, cause he's taking a snooze, okay, the little cat's taking a snooze, <laughs> now that that's over with, 
let's play some videos game. How's everybody doing? One more time around with this. I'm excited to look for secrets and stuff because there's a lot of stuff I missed apparently. So this will be a bonus stream. I've started putting the Final Fantasy X playthroughs up on YouTube right now. I mean, not right now. They started actually on Friday, but you get the idea. They're up and they'll continue to go up. Ugh. Did you know that in this game... Oh my goodness! Look at all those subs. All those grateful people. Oh. Thank you, Kai. I feel like I had something to... Oh, the I, I don't know if you got my text, but I've started putting thumbnails on the YouTube page because graphic design is my passion. Thank you so much for the five subs to the community. I'm sure that Shadow, X1X, Sleepstar44, OMG Level Up. Oh, good OMG Level Up. Uh, Neptic and Tom ST, enjoy the subs. And how are you, Kai? How are you feeling? Hey Marsh, what's your favorite thing about Gino? I love, are you like setting me up for something? Cause you know what I'm gonna say? Did... It's okay, it's okay. I actually don't have to go live. It's, it's only been seven minutes. Nothing's really stopping me from opening up the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim and just having a grand old night by myself, really. Here, let's go back full screen. Um, I mean, not full screen, the other one. Um, no, let's, cause who cares about this? You've seen it a million times. Go on YouTube and watch it. Um, can y'all hear me okay? I'm discharged and trying to, I'm not gonna stream Skyrim. Maybe when I do the main quest and I'm like level 40, I'll stream Skyrim with my level 40 orc vampire that's at level 100 smithing and like level 75 sneak archery. Um, that's not where I am at right now, but that's about where I'll be at when I make my way back to fucking Whiterun. I'm discharged and trying to recover at home, but still real sick. Ooh, I'm sorry to hear that. Playing lots of Animal Crossing, yeah. So I don't know what, um, what's in the recovery plan, but whatever's in it, make sure you do it. I blew up my third island and trying to make a goth dark academia. It really blows that you can only have one island per system. Franny, just cut that out. Not yet. I'm deleting that one. Try again. Goth dark academia. God damn. Oh yeah, and you, cause you had to refund city skylines. Cause I was like, what about city building? But they, oops. I heard the city skyline two launch was, yeah, like that. I've just finished, that's better Franny. Was it, I don't even, I don't want to ask who or what was in that episode of Star Trek. I really don't. Marsh Streams forgets to turn off those mods. What, my graphics mods? Cause I don't have any, I actually looked into um, NPC mods, but the NPC mods for Skyrim are like, that's like next level. Cause you can customize everything. And it's like, no, I just want them to be prettier. I don't want them to look like 2011 anymore. That's all I want. I don't want to have to do all that shit myself. I know, cause, cause prettier is so subjective. Just make Todd do it. I actually mostly like the NPCs in Starfield. I know they're kind of fish loops, but I mostly like the NPCs in Starfield. Oh, it was the Tribbles episodes? Oh, for, wait, you don't know. I was playing Act 3 in Baldur's Gate 2, but it's too stressful, not good for sick recovery. Yeah. Ooh, um, House Flipper 2 comes out soon. I'm excited for that. The mods just want to know if you want their butts to be 39. Yeah, but I don't... I don't want to put in numbers. I don't want to do that. My, my visual mods were enough already. I'm not going to start modding characters and gameplay and all that. I'm good. I installed Sky UI. I'm happy. Anyway, speaking of RPGs. Oh. 
Where did he go? I just want letters. No, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I used to follow. Oh, hi. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He teleported. Hi, buddy. Don't drink my water, please. He doesn't want to look at the camera. He's shy. rubbing on my TV. I need to try peak whiskey. I don't drink very neat, but thank you. Oh, she's precious. I like peach tea. This is Toppy. He's super precious. He's the prince boy. How are you, Lissa? Franny, I'm gonna let that one slide because I know you mean I'm petting the baby. He's my baby. Here's my here's my stream setup, by the way. If you ever wondered what's my what's that? You wonder? Of course, this is my lucky Amy Rose figurine that I it's never far from for some reason. Happy. Peach Sodi. I don't know about peach sodies. Hi emo queen. I'm going to give everybody I'm going to give everybody a shout out soon. I've just I've got one hand on the camera and the other hand on my pet. Just like Alanis Morissette said in the 90s. Peachza. Oh, I know you don't need one, Lissa. How are you doing emo queen? How are you doing, Lissa? I had um so the last time I was in California, I went to a place called Butcher's Daughter, which they also have a location in Brooklyn, but they have one in Venice, uh, in Los Angeles. And um, I got a, a pizza that had, it was a, a flatbread. No, it wasn't a flatbread. It was a pizza, but it had like fig on it. I'm trying to remember what else it had. It had like arugula and fig. It sounds awful, but it was really good. I have a picture of it somewhere. Hi, Toppy. It might have been pear. I really can't remember. It was really good, though. It was like a white pizza. It was great. And it was sweet. So it was a sweet pizza. And I've never really had a sweet pizza before. Not like a dessert pizza. It was still like a meal. He's got his head dug in right where the switch is. Moppy. He's rubbing his face on the monitor. Hello, buddy. Hi, buddy. Yeah. Brie, I think it was Brie. Yeah. It was some kind of soft cheese. Yes, because it, it might have been like goat cheese, though. It was really good, though. Well, he's trying to get on top of my CRT. Buddy. We're just going to pet the boy until... There he goes. He wants my other hand. He wants... You see, I'm already petting him, but he wants the... <laughs> he wants this hand. Hi, buddy. Hi. I'm letting the people see me pet you. There you go. Look, he's looking at my hand. He wants it. Aww. He wants the controller because that's what I put my hand on. He said no video games. Just pets. I want all the food. I haven't had pizza for... Hello, Shiho. Yes, we uh, usually are playing video games, but right now we're playing the best video game of all. Pet the cat. Oh, there. Game over. Yeah. Oh, you like Peach? Nice. My favorite character in this game is Mallow. But welcome, Shiho. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm doing post game right now. I have, um, let me show it real quick. I have a full clear. I don't know about full clear, but I, I cleared the game. He is now hiding. What do you got there? 
He absconded with one of my guitar picks. You can't let this boy have anything. Hello, Joshua. My favorite character was Booster. I'm, oh, I do like Booster. I like Booster and I like Cinder Toad. <laughs> A big Cinder Toad fan. Big Cinder Toad fan here. Let me drink some water. Let's give some shout outs real quick. I wish they added DK. What are you talking about? They have, um... They have Gorilla. And they have, um... Oh, here he's back. Can't keep a good boy down. Oh, expand the party. Yeah. And Ed Kitty is DLC. There aren't any cat... I guess there's Cat Mario. Stream Diddy Kong Racing. So... Here, let me advertise. Happy. Where are you going? Uh... Now he wants to get in the screen. So, I've got a subathon coming up next week. I think it's going to be on Tuesday. Next Tuesday, not tomorrow Tuesday. So, the 12th. And I'm going to put out a, a poster with all the details and all the rewards and redeems and everything. But one of the redemptions, if you sub enough or bits enough, is you can pick the game I'm playing. And, well, if you want to see Diddy Kong Racing, that's a way to do it. It's the only way you're going to get Marsh to play fucking Diddy Kong Racing for any reasonable amount of time. And that's the other thing. So I'll set it to be like a time. Like you can re re request to play the game for a certain amount of time depending on how much you gift. What do we get for donating $1,000? Um, Diddy Kong Racing isn't that bad. I'd play it. I've... I played worse. Oh my goodness! Puppy, dance with me. Oh my goodness. Okay, hold on. Um, thank you. <laughs> Thanks so much for the raid, Autumn. I was lurking in your stream, so now I'm lurking in my own stream. Oh boy, Toppy is now trying to get on the switch. Hello, Autumn. What were you playing? I feel like I know you what you were playing. Oh yeah, Transistor! I was gonna come in and make a horrible, like... Cause you had a, you had a pun title as well. Um, welcome to the stream. That isometric game that isn't Bastion. Thank you for the lurk, thank you for the raid. Uh, I wanna shout some people out real quick. Um, who came in. And then we can maybe start the stream. Toppy is... It, I don't know what he's doing right now. I don't think he knows what he's doing either. At this rate, he's gonna unplug my stream box because he's sniffing around it. So if everything shuts off, it's my cat's fault, but we'll forgive him, won't we? Oh, and now he's back. He's, he's, he doesn't know what he's doing. Toppy, can you figure yourself out, please? Sorry, that's how I talk to him. Oh, he might've disconnected my mouse for real. Buddy. You ever have a cat? Have you ever had a cat? Have you ever just had a cat? <laughs> My goodness. Pet me, pet me, pet me, pet me, pet me, pet me, pet me. He doesn't know what he's doing. All right. Let me shout outs real quick. Hello, Emo Queen. You have two cats. I have two cats as well. I almost spelled your name the old way with the two O's. Congrats on getting the single O. I know you've had it for a while. I'm just shouting people out and then I'll catch up with chat. How's everything going with everyone? All right, catching up with chat. Thanks again, Autumn Fit Corfay, for the raid. We're, we were mid convo, mid cat pet, mid everything. Welcome to the stream, Raiders. I'm Marsh, and I'm playing Super Mario RPG. I enjoy RPGs, and I enjoy Mario games. So if you put them together, you get this. So in the future, you will see me playing jumpy games and turn basey games. Marsh never going to say what I get for $10,000. I'll figure it out. Um, Emo Queen has two cats, right? Have you seen the cat ham ass meme? I can't say that I have, but honestly, Majesty kind of has a ham ass. A thousand and two dollars. Well, I could tell you what to do with the two dollars. You hated the two O's. So was there someone named Emo Queen that you nabbed it from? Um, how was Roblox, Joshua? Okay, for a thousand dollars. Oh, that's cute, actually. 
Here, it's I mean, everyone can open up the ham ass, right? For a thousand dollars. What should I do for a thousand dollars? Because I'm making the 50 sub threshold. Um, I never even thought about emu, like M O O. I never even thought about that. That's ripe for bullying. Um, for 50 subs, I'm gonna shave my beard. If you make it, if you not for one person, it's it's cumulative. Can you imagine one person gifting 50 subs? Then I'd shave my eyebrows. Right, Duffy. I'm not putting that on the list though. Yeah, for a thousand dollars, I'll shave my eyebrow. Am I gonna shave my beard on stream? Yeah. I would do it live. Like, um, he's back. Hello, fantasies. I would do it live like uh, that guy who said do it live that one time. Oh, he's up on the TV. Okay. Well, he'll figure that out. Bye, kitty. Hello, fantasies. Have you played Super Mario? You played Super Mario RPG, right? And just not on stream. Because you stream Final Fantasy. Final Fantasies and Dreams. What Dreams games? That's what I want to know. Anyway, welcome to the stream. We're playing video games. Can you believe it? How many minutes into the stream? You stream on PS5. They should put this game on PS5. Oh, Mario's asleep. Okay, even better. A thousand dollars you grow out your beard to a thousand millimeters? That would take a while. How are you today, Lissa? I don't know if I don't know if I saw you in here before, so if you were in my chat earlier, I apologize. Welcome to the stream. How's Guild Wars treating you? You know, I'm thinking about getting into old school RuneScape. Wouldn't that be terrible? You need a capture card for Switch, yeah. Oh my gosh. Don't let me on. Let me on the stream, please. You wanna say something? You wanna say something to the people? Say something. They all want to hear you. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, Baronade. Oh, my subathon thing is wrong. I'm, I'm at 500. I don't know why it says 499. I'm well. Guild Wars 2. Whoop. Guild Wars 2 always treats me well. Go for RuneScape, not ter so. But the thing that bugs me about old school RuneScape. Okay, listen. That's how you, this, you just want to find out how old Marsh is? Here it is, right here. Old school RuneScape. I remember when that shit was called RuneScape 2. Old school RuneScape isn't even the original iteration of RuneScape. It's the 2006 version. And back then, Jagex called that shit RuneScape 2. You can't fool me. Not old school enough. It has 3D models. I want to look at... <laughs> I want to look at sprites. Hashtag Marsh Facts. Hashtag Old Marsh. Hashtag Cranky Old Man. Hashtag Played RuneScape in Middle School and now I'm four years old. Three weeks! Watch streak! Oh no, three three streams. Not three weeks. But I'll take three weeks. Bop. Thanks for watching, Fantasies. I appreciate it. Because I've been playing so much RPG. Alright. Oh, my cat is back. Your body is collapsing? Oh no, Rainbow. I'm so sorry to hear that. How's, um, how's everything? <laughs> it's great. As you come in and say my body is collapsing. A stretch break. Okay, if my shit gets disconnected, it's my cat's fault. Oh my goodness. He's on my ring light. I wish I could show you this. Okay, buddy, I'm, I gotta, here, here's a stretch. I'm gonna stretch myself, okay, ready? Buddy, you're stepping on my controls even. Is that a stretch? Is that enough of a stretch? He knocked my Super Mario Brothers 3 t-shirt box down. My friend in Japan bought me that t-shirt and uh, for my birthday one year. And I actually don't like the shirt, but it's a great gift because I love the box. So I just keep the shirt in the box. 
And then it's it's still wrapped. So someday if I ever want to get rid of it, which I probably won't, it's at least still wrapped. Big stretch. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm waiting for you to get to a certain area. So I'm in post game now. Um, but I've looked at stuff. I looked it up. I did what you had to spend probably 50 USD to do in the 90s. Looked at a guide, baby. Wanna buy a painting? Um, if, you, uh, if I hadn't just had to make a horrible car insurance payment. Listen, I don't want to make my shit real. I just... I love throwing money at people. I, I... Let's talk offline, Puck. Yeah, I understand. I think he did something to my freaking mouse. He fucked with the mouse acceleration. I know he did. I know he did. That cat fucked with my mouse acceleration. Garfield! Um, I still have that guide. It didn't cost much and it was pretty thin. Oh, that reminds me. Shit. Okay, one thing. No, it's okay. Um, I do get paid in 11 days also. I know that's, you know, 11 days can be a slim margin, but anyway, let's talk offline. He is fighting himself. Let's do full screen. I'll be right back. You're welcome. I was halfway through being bent over. All right. Yeah, if they want to come in here, they can. So, I had this book as a kid. This is not the copy of the book I had as a kid. I had this one and I had the, the sequel, like 101 more Nintendo Secrets Revealed. I got this book at the Scholastic Book Fair. This book sold for three ninety five USD or five ninety five Canadian puck um, by Terry Munson and Paul Shinoda. The sequel, one hundred and one more Nintendo Secrets Revealed, is on the Internet Archive Library. This one is not, but I remembered that there was a tip in here about Super Mario RPG. Cause I remember being a kid and reading through here and being like, what the fuck is Super Mario RPG? That doesn't even sound real. So you open this up. You got focus, please. Focus, please. Focus, please. I don't know. Um, Super Mario games on page 83, okay? That's what it says. Just take my, take my word for it. The cats are fighting. So go to page 83. There's stuff for Donkey Kong in here. There's stuff for Donkey Kong. Um, like there's Super Nintendo stuff in here. Like there's Donkey Kong Country, Donkey Kong Country uh, 2, Donkey Kong Country 3, Donkey Kong Land 2. There's a lot of Donkey Kong stuff in here. And I remember reading through this whole guide and being like, I didn't know people like Donkey Kong that much. Harvest Moon and fucking Glover. More Harvest Moon. You want tips for Harvest Moon, not Harvest Moon 64. Harvest Moon on the Super Nintendo. Iggy's Wrecking Balls. Get your balls in the chat if you remember Iggy's Wrecking Balls. Uh, depending on the emote that you choose to use. Kirby's Avalanche was another one where I read through this. I knew who Kirby was, but I was like, what is Kirby's Avalanche? It's Poyo Poyo. Uh, Legend of the River King. It's a Legend of Zelda stuff. Madden 64. Mega Man X3. Mega Man X3. Like, why? Um, Pokemon. How many Pokemon tips are in here? Hold on. The biggest game. Two Pokemon tips. Just just to give you a preview, by the way, of, of the quality of tips and tricks in... 101 Nintendo Secrets. So some of these have 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 codes like Banjo Kazooie. The Banjo Kazooie page I remember actually using. It has codes for the game. Red feathers, eggs, lives, gold feathers. 
If you want to cheat at Banjo-Kazooie, here's your guide to do it. $4 at the book fair. By comparison, here's the tips for Pokemon. In Pokemon for the Game Boy, there's an amusement park called the Safari Zone that's filled with rare Pokemon. Some of these Pokemon live in the zone only and nowhere else. True or false, there's a trick that allows you to find these Pokemon outside of the zone. And then it teaches you the Seafoam Island Surf Trick. Enter this, it tells you how to get missing no. This book tells you how to get missing no. True or false? There's a trick that allows you to copy Pokemon and not just trade them. These are not cheats. These are... <laughs> These are glitches. <laughs> anyway... Let's skip ahead to Super Mart. Wait, what's this? Some of these are just like weird random trivia, like Star Fox 64. In one of the sectors, you can actually fly to the docking bay in the rear of the Great Fox Mothership to repair your fighter. Can you do this in sector X, Y, or Z? And then it's not like hidden, like right underneath it says sector Z. So like, I don't know why they had to phrase it that way. Okay, Mario time. You got Super Mario Kart. Super Empire Strikes Back. I don't remember that Mario game. You got Super Mario 64, which tells you about when Mario gets his hat knocked off. And you have Super Mario RPG. So let me read you the Super Mario RPG trick. True or false, you can perform a trick to build your experience levels automatically. Wow, that sounds really good, right? By the way, that is the only Mario RPG trick in the book. We go back to more Star Wars. So it's, by the way, so it's, by the way, it's Super Empire Strikes Back, and then it's Super Mario stuff. <laughs> and then there's more Star Wars. Um, true or false, you can perform a trick to build your experience levels automatically. Are you ready for this, folks? I paid $20 because I remembered that this book had a Super Mario RPG trick in it. True, you can perform a trick to build your experience levels automatically. But you need a controller with a turbo option. When you reach Booster's Tower, by the way, I told, I remember reading this as a kid and being like, who the fuck is Booster? Did they misspell Bowser? When you reach Booster's Tower, give true form pins to all the characters in your party. Go up to the second floor to the staircase where the snippets are falling down in an endless stream. Face the stairs and set the A button on your controller to turbo. Your party will fight and collect experience automatically. The true form pins will protect your party from the sniffed spells, and your characters will earn enough hit points to keep them going. Did you know in role-playing games you can grind? No, Mallow's in, in Mario Arp Oh my goodness! They are getting restless because they need to eat dinner. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed. That's Marsh's Marsh's guide to 101 Nintendo Secrets Revealed. Maybe for my subathon, I'll read more Nintendo Secrets Revealed. I should make that a um, a points reward. For every point reward, someone gets one Nintendo Secret Revealed. Um, I still like the old trick of holding down right on the D-pad in the second control of Mega Man 3 to be immortal and do big jumps. Is that a glitch or something that they meant to do? Anyway, hey. Hey, Juwan. Juwan, go crazy! You're here, and I'm gonna shut you out. How's your streams been going? How's Ark, dinosaurs? We're gonna play the game now. 30 minutes into the stream. 30, 35 minutes into the stream. Which started 45 minutes late. Isn't this why you're here, though? You're not here to see video games. You're here to listen to Marsh read 101 Nintendo Secrets Revealed by Terry Munson and Paul Shinoda. Includes, it says Pokemon on the back! And the only Pokemon things are get missing no or clone your Pokemon, which are two things you're not supposed to be able to do in the game. It says, Includes Pokemon and all your favorite games. It doesn't name any others. Includes Pokemon. 
And this was when Pokemon was brand new because there's no Pokemon Stadium, Pokemon Snap. No, just Pokemon, which is, of course, red and blue. I've been going good. I got my new truck today. What kind of truck? Hell yeah. Um, I'm good. I've, I've been really energized today, too. Can y'all tell? Fuck. Do you want to play a video game? <gasps> okay, hold on. <gasps> Mario, you're awake. You looked like you were fast asleep. You didn't dream about defeating Smithy, did you? Glad I caught you before you went off to the factory. I got you this prison. Mario got a stay voucher. Take a night to rest up in the Mary Moore suite before the last push. That's all I had for you. Hope you enjoy your stay in the suite. Um... 06 GMC Sierra Denali, nice. What did we just get? Now that you've uh, now that you finished the game, sound player and play report have been added to the journal. Now that you've cleared the game, the names of monsters that were question marked in the monster list have been unlocked. So does that mean Peach was just hiding an unknown monster in her room? Oh, a monster, oh. Let's say no more about that. Stay voucher. Oh, it's just a free voucher to stay at the Marymore. Okay. I mean, why not? So I looked up some stuff about this game, by the way. As I said. And we're gonna find it all. But first, since the game is like, you should go to Marymore, let's go to Marymore. Do 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 Oh yeah, what happens if we go to the hill now? Hmm. Okay. Nothing. <laughs> my dream, I, my dream like classic car, it's genuinely fucking classic at this point. I want a fucking like 1999 Chevrolet Camaro SS. I don't know why. I just really want one. Welcome to Get Married More. You can get married. <laughs> Did you know? Okay, let's stay in the place. This place is heaven for the rich and famous. You have a stay voucher. You're going to love our hotel's fine suite. The bellhop will show you your room. Please enjoy your stay. Hey! I'm the bellhop. Hop! I wonder if anything special will happen, because we've stayed here like... Three times. Camaro's a car one as well, but I like older cars. Yeah. I, um... Anything else, sure? He wants a tip. I'll give him a tip. Oh, yeah. So there is a way to, to collect tips. If you're broke and stay here, presumably without a voucher, they and you can't pay for your stay, they will make you work to pay off your... Like, your bill. No, not the tip. Just because Franny's not here doesn't mean the rest of you gotta make it up for him, okay? Um, my friend, when I was in high school, actually, her dad... Oh, I am here. Damn. That's even worse, because Franny's being well-behaved. So what's your excuse? Being British. Um... Oh my god, when I was in high school, my friend, her dad, had preserved, like, a 78 Camaro. And it had on the locks, it had the window locks, and it had they had skull tips on the window locks. And he had preserved it for her for when she got driving age, so she drove that thing everywhere. It was fucking sick. Okay, let's go to sleep. Do I need an excuse? I'm just gonna... <laughs> nah, you don't need an excuse. Oh, is something weird gonna happen to us? Oh! Oh, Gino! Hmm. <laughs> Well, that was different. I'm glad we did that. Oh, Gino. I saw a bright light through the window during the night. I believe it came from Star Hill. 
Why don't we go find out what might have caused it? Okay. All right, we'll do all this before we do the secret stuff, I guess. Oh, but while people are here, I want to show you the secret code for this game, though. This, this is really cool. This game has a secret code. This should have been in the book, but they took it out of the American version originally. So here's the secret code, okay? Ready? Down, up, right, left, L-R-L-R-B. You found a secret code! I wonder what it did. Let's check your stats. Hmm, looks like nothing changed. Well, maybe it gave you some experience. Hmm, no, that's still the same too. I'll level with you. There aren't any other codes. And this one will do the same thing every time. Though I'm always happy to hang out with you if you want to try it again. That's all for the secret code. Ta-da! Bye. There you go, the secret code. Did, did we not like the secret code? Thought it was a good code. More games should have secret codes that do nothing. Good morning. I hope you were able to sleep well. You betcha. Okay, here's another complimentary gift. If it's complimentary, why is it mid? Mm. Okay, now we want to go to Star Hill. Okay. So now we're at Star Hill. We could go back to Marymore. Drew Marymore. There we go to Star Hill. I wonder if there's going to be like a... Oh, nope. We'll find out. Nothing seems to have changed here. Let's keep looking further in. Wish I had some cricket jam. Oh, hey, there's this item. I never used this item. Want to find out what this does? So I thought you could only use these with throwfers, but that's wrong. But you want to find out what these do since we're getting a little degenerated here? Throw for cookie. We're going to use it, okay? Oh, wait. I'll wait to use it. I'll wait to use that. Nice. There's a reason I'm waiting to use it, actually, because it heals. I hope my baby's cute. Oh, this guy. Well, never mind. Can't wait to start a family. I wish I weren't such a crybaby. Oh, that's, uh, that's Mallow's wish. Yeah, if there's an enemy, um, like, deeper in here, I'll use that against them. Well... Okay, we're gonna use it and see what it does, okay? Because I have no reason to use this item. Here we go, throw for cookie. Here it is, it's a cookie. The throw for comes out of the ground and for some reason it attacks us and then throws a bomb at itself and then it's confused and crying and then it goes Mree! and then it heals us for exactly 69 HP. that exact amount every time no matter what you do the throw for cookie will heal you for 69 HP Rawr. Uh, let's double our coins nice yes thank you it is pretty nice Uh, okay. I, I waited the whole game to use it because I didn't know what it did. And then I watched a video that said what it did and I was like, no way. It's really 69. Because 69, it's a, um, it's a pun in Japanese. It has nothing to do with that. I don't recall this star being here before. It must be where that light was coming from. There seem to be a few others too. Perhaps some new wishes have fallen here? The Frog Sage might know more. 
I hope this is my big break. I've got something special to show off. Hmm, these are interesting. I'm itching for a heated duel. I wish someone would do something about this cake. Are these all related to the boss battles? My throat's all screechy. Make it stop. Meow. I want a new... Wait. I want our new master to show us his moves. He does, he does like a, a that type of thing. Show me your moves. I don't think that's Captain Falcon though. I want to be the best treasure hunter in the world. I, the Dark Knight of Vonda, await the one destined to challenge me. Yeah, these seem like uh, enemies. Okay, the door's open. May Mallow fix the starway. I cannot stream 3DS games, but if I downloaded Citra, I probably could. Uh, so are these all the same stars then? Yeah. I want to help out my older brother, Mario. Uh, now we're going to the Tadpole Pond. I don't know what game you're thinking. There's so many good 3DS games. Oh, I would have to start a new Fantasy Life save because I don't think, I don't have my 3DS configured for like capture cards. So it would have to be a new save file. Bellame? Well, shoot, I don't want to go to Bellame. Really? I don't even know where Bellame lives. No, like, I actually don't. <laughs> Bellame has, like, a castle. Oh, man. I don't remember where Bellame lives. Oh, Bellame's in Land's End. Okay. There we go. Let's go bother Bellame, I suppose. Hello. Uh, tell my fortune. Hit the faces in any order and you'll receive your fortune. Oh, okay. Oh, that's new. If you proceed through the pipe next door, you'll have a great meal sometime in the future. Well, I like that. I got a cookie. Nothing bad could happen to me now. Nope. Nothing bad could happen to me now. Oh, okay. See? And nothing bad did happen. What about it? Huh. Aha! Well, there you go. The yellow tile will get you to the next room. If you're lucky, you'll run into Bellame. Oh, shit. Well, I want a delicious meal, though. Mmm, I'm so hungry. Wish I had something to eat. I'm so tired. Hello, Master Blastoise. How are you? My cat just ate so fast. Yeah, I, I, 
I'm tired. How are you? Tired. Hey, look. This guy again? Didn't he take the hint after you beat him up? Twice? I really hope you settle down by now. Man, well, my throat is scratchy. It's making me all grumpy. He seems real riled up. I think he's scarier than the last time we saw him. Bro, is that any way for one of my minions to talk? Get it together! You're right. He's tougher than last time, but so am I! We beat him twice, and we can do it again! I'm now letting him push me around! All three Lord of the Rings movies? That's a lot of walking around, huh? Okay, Mallow time. Okay, Bellamy's weak to lightning, fear, poison, and mute. My boat's all scratchy. Life would be better if it wasn't. Okay. Let's do some jumps. Damn. Okay. Fart time. What are they barking for? Okay. Okay. Shocker. Gotcha. I think we can do it. I really can't do commentary while I do this. Just gotta stare at the screen. Damn! Oh, that's a lot of walking. Yeah? Oh, because dogs like to... Boo! It's like when I say, when I do stuff like, people are like, I got my speakers on, and I'm like, okay, Google. You all look delicious, but how do you taste? Oh, they can only have one status effect on them at once. Eh, sour, but there we are. But it's Mario. Hi, okay. I think I've already scanned Mario clone, actually. Um, but let's use Thunderbolt on both of them. Yep. Maybe we can jump forever on Mario clone. Mario jumps on Mario. The timing of this is so weird with like the sound desync and the frame delay. Fuck! My dogs are barking means my feet hurt? That's a new one for old Marshy. Wait, you're resistant now, crap. Okay, that's okay. Um, Let's do shocker. Gotcha, hell yes. Um, well now it's weak to poison, or now it's strong to poison, so let's get Gino out here. Uh, uh, Gino punch. Okay, that does 145. Why the hell? Uh-oh, that's why the hell. Hi, I'm Gino. I'm going to kill you. Gino, why'd you do that? I'm not going to dignify that with an answer. Mario's still asleep. Weak to fire and ice. Truth is, I don't care one bit about star pieces. Aurora Borealis? Mario! Oh, and Mallow. Oh, fuck. Okay, hold on. Oh, it's weak to ice. Um, try it.
Hey. Can't block. Okay. Are you for reals? Bowser. Can we poison it now, please? Hey, we sure can. Okay. Uh, switch to Gino. Okay. No, don't eat Bowser! Oh, boy. Whoa. Oh, no, don't fart! We need Peach back. Oh, it like, this is nuts. Oh, th enjoy the nap. I hope it's refreshing. Okay, this is tough. This is a tough battle. I need to buy some stuff at the store. Thank you. Uh, what's Bowser week two? We don't know. We need royal syrup, though. Uh, Bowser, switch out for G and Mallow. There we go. Mallow's awake. No, you can't also make a Geno clone. Oh. This is tough. This is tougher than I thought it'd be. Thanks. I'm glad we're practicing on these before doing Culex, though. I want to thaw peek at Bowser. Against my better judgment. Weak to ice. What a rollicking good time. Okay, fireball. Oh my goodness, crud. Oh, we're in trouble. We are in trouble. No wonder Peach is like an important white mage character. Uh, come back, Mario. Thank you. Nice. Okay, now super fireball against just Gino. Get out of here, Gino. Not Aurora again. I'm gonna fucking lose it. Uh, party cleanse. Now Peach is gonna use um, group hug, and now Mario is gonna use a big old bonkin bonk attack. That's not very good, but it is an attack. And now we're all gonna fall asleep again. Oh boy, everyone's asleep. Oh my goodness. Look at that, Peach gets one chance. Are you for real? Cause Peach has no speed. Oh. What is this comboing? This is illegal, man. Wow. Well, maybe I'll go look up, uh, go look up some secrets first. Uh, that's embarrassing. Okay, well guess what? <laughs> Mario woke up one day and received an invitation to go 
sleep at the Marymore Hotel. And then he went and did it. Really fast, because he already did it on stream. Because I'll tell you exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to go do that, and then I'm going to go do the other thing, and then I'm not going to read all those things. And then I'm going to save. Not now. No. Not now. I want to stay in the hotel. So, uh, there's other secret stuff you can find in this game, like and such as. Uh. I'll give him a tip. There's a secret mini game I want to show you. I might do the, um, like the secret bosses on my own, bosses. I might do those on my own. I didn't realize how much, um, how much grinding they took. Well, they might not take grinding, but they're, they're certainly not easy. So maybe in the future there will be a a second last Mario RPG stream. Yeah, they're not easy. <laughs> I was gonna try. Q I'll definitely try Culex though. But first, I want to do some other stuff because I did find some cool secrets online. Um, that maybe I should have showed first, but that's okay. I wanted to follow along what the game was showing me. Oh, that was different. Um, so now they want me to go to Star Hill. I just won't have to do this real quick. One thing I'm not going to do is the Yoshi thing. Sorry. Sorry to everyone who wants to see fat Yoshi. Um, I, I actually spoiled myself on a little bit of Culex in this game, sadly. Um, but I, I know that I saw Culex. I opened his door. So I get his whole deal. I played the music. I love fat Yoshi. I know a lot of people love fat Yoshi. Um... The unfortunate reality is that I'm not doing that fucking Yoshi minigame. Also, I need to grind on level appropriate enemies. Oh, and I need to replenish my, um... My items. That's an important thing to do. I was waiting for you to meet Kelex. Oh, I can go do it again. That's... I've done that. I did that midway through because I had the shiny stone and I made it to Monster Town. So I was like, oh, what's behind this door? <laughs> I tried fighting him. You want to see me try fighting him again? All right, and the Frog Sage might know more. So I think I'll go talk to the Frog Sage real quick. And then and then we'll go do talk to Culex. I did the music. Let's see, I'm trying to think of what things I did do. I did the music. I did this asinine thing. Where is it? I got the sheep attack. Someone guided me through that because there's no way I was going to be able to do that naturally. I wanted to see the first time around. Yeah, it was so my reaction to hearing the music really was like, because the music, it's actually what blows my mind is that the music isn't actually the arrangement from Final Fantasy 14. It's a new arrangement with a new sound font. Arranged by Yoko Shimomura, that's almost the same composition as the Final Fantasy IV boss battle theme. Okay, Bellamo is up to his old tricks again. Okay, we're leaving here now. Here's something I want to do. I missed this guy's line about his bazooka. I'm kind of sad about that. I know a lot of people like the bazooka line, and I missed it. Uh, I think I want to go to the hotel. 
And I actually could have seen this when I came back here, but I ignored talking to this kid, so... Hello, Tia. You finish your stream? How is slash was it? So here's this kid. You think our stuff with him was over, right? Oh, wait, wait. Oh, uh, wait. What? Hmm. That seems wrong. Hold on. Uh. I might have, I might have done it wrong. Oh, you have to talk to him a bunch of times. Oh, wait, wait. All right, yes, I'm done here. You want this? It's only 500 coins. Well, sure. Want me to teach ya? Yes, please. I score if you hit the shells with the stars fired from the beetle. If you get hit, recover by firing continuously. Just do it. I'm only doing, uh, always fun. I enjoy the questing part and I can get lost just doing the dailies for hours. That, it is one of those games, huh? Just do it. I am only doing the character quests on stream though. Yeah, someone was asking me about Skyrim and I was like, I'll stream Skyrim when I get around to doing the vanilla quest. Or not the vanilla, but like the main quest. Okay, so now we have, oh, uh, you can now play the pre-owned game, Beatlemania. Try to get a high score. Play it by selecting play game from the menu. That's what we want to do, baby. Pleatlemania. It's Super Mario World. Beetle died. Do all the buttons fire? All the buttons fire. Just, just button mash all day. Just mash all the buttons. Just do it! You can't die, apparently. Or maybe it counts your deaths? And knitting scarves offline. Very valid. Very fun. I just want to beat the high score. You know, Beatlemania isn't as easy as you think it is. As it looks. And maybe if I had a turbo button on my controller. Like that book suggested. This is nuts. This is like not actually that fun. I I read about this and I thought it'd be really fun to play, but it's not. Like um what's that mini game in Final Fantasy 15? Justice Monsters 5. This is about as fun as Justice Monsters 5. This is not I thought this would be really fun. I'd rather play the fucking fly swatting mini game from Mario Paint. I guess cuz Square made it and not Nintendo. Even though it has the Super Mario World background. It's like, what am I doing here? And you can't die. So how do you get a game over? You just press quit? Oh, you can, you can get a game over. Okay. We're gonna beat the high score this time. I don't know how I got such a high score before. I was up to like 4,000, which I don't even understand how that's possible. Just mash the buttons. How was I up to 4,000 before? That's what I don't understand. Is it like your multiplier increases when you're not getting hit? Probably. Do I get a, hey, can anyone tell me if I get a reward for beating the high score on uh, Beatlemania? How was I up to 4,000 earlier? That feels unreal. 
no clue. No clue to how I got my score that high. No clue as to whether you get a reward for it or both. I just realized, yeah, Beetle... You ever hear a Ted Woolsey? He's the guy that put all the references in this game. And even though Nintendo kept most of the original script, they didn't credit him for it. They credited like a dozen people who work at Nintendo of America, but they didn't credit the guy who wrote probably 90% of this game's script. Hmm. Video games. Is it like because the kid was on a high score before? It probably was. Or maybe you like bonk the things into each other. It's really hard not to get hit by the fucking things. Koopas. They're all over the place. What am I supposed to do? I'm about to look up, um... I wish I had a turbo button. This reference doesn't make any sense. What do you mean? It's a beetle and the game is mania. It's like Sonic Mania, but with Beetle. Makes perfect sense. If you're Ted Woolsey and you want to put cultural references in all your fucking game localizations. Who do you think you are, Bruce Lee? They took that one out. I'm just like rubbing my fingers. I wish you could see. All right, hold on. This is silly. When one presses A, B, or Y, a beetle shoots at red Koopas. Toad runs onto the, oh, wait a minute. I want to see this, if this is true. Oh, it must only be on the Super Nintendo version. Because I read that the next time you boot up the game, maybe the next time you boot it up after winning, but apparently you can get a message from Toad where he asks you not to use a controller with a turbo button. <laughs> so they knew. They knew. I don't think I'm going to be able to clear 5,000. I don't know how it, um, how I got to 4,000 before. It must have been magic. Because I sure didn't do it. So it's A, B, and Y. What if I just stand still? What if I stop overthinking it? Don't use a controller with a turbo button, though. Just sit here and mash buttons. This honestly, I think, works better. Uh, maybe not. It feels like results may vary. I wonder if there's like a spot, you know, like a cheat spot where like they won't, they won't bank at you. So you can just keep hitting them forever. Probably not though. Because I don't even get the meta of, like, when they have multiplier. Is it that you bump them into each other? I genuinely cannot tell. Also, the beetle hitbox is obnoxious.
This hurts my forearms. The old Ask C pad. Oh, it hit 128. Get off me. I should use a turbo controller. I'm sure they make one for the Switch. How else are you supposed to play this? They really want you to mash your fucking fingers? So I think once they've dropped, they get different physics. And so they sort of start to bounce around and that's how they hit you from the side no matter where they are. Which is actually smart. It's actually not... I shouldn't complain too much about the game design of this because it's not terrible. It's just like annoying. <laughs> Koopas. This is a weird Mario RPG level. Yeah, this is um I got to level I got to fucking 4000 points on this before somehow. I'm playing uh Mole Mania. No, what's it called? Uh Beetle Mania. There's got to be a spot where you don't get hit. I feel like someone would mention it on the internet if there was. Kill Ringo. Why Ringo? Oh, poor Ringo. He didn't do nothing to nobody. I swear on me, mum. I don't think you get a prize for beating it, though. Which is cruel of them to have a high score. Enjoy dinner, Autumn. We're gonna get these gosh dang shells. If it's the last gosh dang thing I gosh dang do. Gosh dang it. Yeah, it's like you knock them into each other for, for combo points almost, I think. And they're doing like sine wave bounces. Oh, do you see those? Those were some juicy combos. That might've been how I cracked 4,000 before without even noticing it. My forearms can only take so much stress. No, this isn't gonna be like punch out. I'm gonna mash my way to the top. Yo! Well, that did it. Oh my goodness, wait, what's this? A heart from the Legend of Zelda? I thought we were playing Super Mario RPG. Huh. What did I? I don't even know what I said. Well, I beat the high score by a lot. I'm never gonna play Beatlemania ever again. So, everyone who got to see me play Beatlemania one time, you got to see me play it the only time. There's also a different background. Um, I'm using the Mario background because if you put Bowser in the middle slot, you get the Mario World background. But if you put Gino in the middle slot, you get a different background. I'll show that for a demo, but I'm not going to play it. Because I'm not going to beat this high score. <laughs> this is one and done. Any YouTubers you should binge? Uh, yeah, actually, exclamation point YouTube for my recommendations for great YouTubers. Come on. Yeah! Will Marsh crack 2,000? 20,000? Probably not. Oh! I did it anyway! Self esteem be damned. I'm the king of Beatlemania. John Lennon, eat your fucking heart out. There's a great YouTuber you can binge. We did it. Do I even get a prize? No. Just, you you got a prize, you did it because you did it, sucker. All right, so now you put Peach in the middle instead of Bowser, look what happens. Hey, look, now it's clouds, whoa, it's so different, whoa.
Wow. It's clouds. Okay, save our high score. Fuck yeah. My forearms really fucking hurt now. Um, okay. So there's that one secret. What other secrets can we get? This list of secrets that I looked up on the internet. Oh, yeah! I gotta go back to Booster's Tower. I forgot about this one. Oh, nice. There's actually a spot for Knife Guy's ball game. Because <sighs> we have to do this. Wanna play? Guess which hand the yellow ball is in. If you can, now watch carefully. Right hand. Very good. Here, a prize goes to the winner. Now we have to do this a bunch more times. Wanna play? Guess which hand the yellow ball is in. If you can, now watch carefully. It's this one. Very good. A prize goes to the winner. And now we gotta play again. Wanna play? Guess which hand the yellow ball is in. It's in this one. Very good. And we gotta play again. Wanna play? Guess which hand the yellow ball is in. It's this one. And we gotta play again. Wanna play? Guess which hand the yellow ball is in. This one. Very good. I'm right on the winner. Now we have to play again. Why? Who the old balls in? It's this one. Very good. This one. Very good. Okay, yeah, we get to play again. Why? This one. Now we get to play again. Wanna play? Now we get to play again. Oh wait, I mean, very good. Now we get to play again. I'm keeping my mental concentration on this terrible game. It's this one. Now we get to play again. Hug. It's this one. Whoa! Congratulations! You deserve this! Okay, great. We got the card. Hello, Warrior Cats Fangirl22. How you been busy? Tracking, or how you been? Sorry, I was reading you saying you were busy. How's trafficking, trafficking earthquakes been? Also, I know a couple of people who are into Warrior Cats now. That's cool. I'll let you get into my brother's casino. Wherever that is. Ah! Mmm, if only we had some sort of guide to tell us where the casino is. This is actually really goofy. You want to know where the casino is? This is really silly. Oh, I don't want to fight you. How are you, fangirl? Are you, uh... Oh, you don't have a Nintendo s system, do you? Okay, Gino. 7.6? Oh, the Philippines. That's tough for an island. All right. Yeah. Okay, not bad, actually. So I have to go over here first and foremost, and then from over here, it's fine. Oops, it's fine. You have an, oh, you have a Switch. Are you interested in playing this game? Not Among Us. Damn it. I have to work on my combos. Thank you, Franny. Yeah, it's great. The composer, so this is the composer for Final Fantasy XV. Mario, 
I level up again. I'm a higher level than Scoopy. Yeah. Okay. Me too. I didn't play the original either. I love this game. It's great. It's one of my favorites this year. Even though it's a lot older. I think this game is older than you, Fangirl. <laughs> okay, so now we're over here. And we have to go here. This is so silly. Crap. Oh, baby. Oh. Tears of the Kingdom, though, you did zero story yet? That's what's great about Tears of the Kingdom and games like that. Like, you can play so much game without doing story. So you go down here, right? You go over here. Remember I thought this chain chomp was suspicious? Oh, Bowser. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I'm petting my cat. Sleep sauce, ew, do not goo your sleep sauce on me. I've only been around for one earthquake and I was in the ocean when it happened, so I didn't feel anything. Um, let's switch to Mallow. Yay! Mallow is so precious. So I'm not doing story stuff, so hopefully you shouldn't be spoiled by this. But it is post-game. Chomp chomp. Let's do Thunderbolt. Yeah! You used to live in California, I imagine. I've been to California multiple times, but I have not uh, experienced an earthquake. Toppy, can you chill? And then jump around to reveal. This is so weird. So then you reveal a hidden block here. And then here's the casino. You were in the first grade and slept through every earthquake. How common were slash are earthquakes? Oh, this is the Mario Brothers 3 music. I wanna hear what the original sounded like. That's about right for the casino in Mario Brothers 3. Oh. Please enjoy yourself. Please enjoy yourself. Um. Welcome to the memory game table. Play around with me, sir. Require instructions. Maybe you don't remember? Yes, please. The memory game tests your ability to remember things. I will line up 10 cards face up, showing you and your friends on them. How'd I get these cards with pictures of you and your friends? Buddy, I'm the one who's asking the questions here, capiche? You will have three seconds to memorize everyone's positions and don't cheat and take screenshots, you gabrone. Before I flip the cards over, I will then ask questions such as, which card shows Mario? And you will make your guess. Guess right, and you win. Three correct guesses in a row wins a prize, but guess wrong even once, and you must start all over. So how about it? Would you like to play the memory game and not cheat? I will show you the cards for just a few seconds, and this dialogue box does not count. Toad, Toad, Gino, Toad, Bowser, Mallow. Actually, I remember that. Let's see if I can get this. Which card is Mario's? Hey! I did that for legit. It looks like you won, Mario. Get your prize. Oh, a cleansing juice? Do you want to continue? Um, I'm about to find out. <laughs> I 
Forks? No, no one wants to actually live in Forks. I knew a girl who had family in Forks. Oh, it's different in, in, cause casino in, um, it's different than the Super Nintendo version and there's no guide for the Super Nintendo version. Hello, okay-ish? I don't, I want a guide to the games. The memory game rewards, okay, they're random. These rewards are not great. Hello, okay-ish? How are you doing? How'd you like control earlier? I was lurking in that after Sarah raided. Actually, let's shout out. Actually, I don't remember how to spell her name. You love it, that's great. Welcome to the Great Guy Casino. Wanna play prize blocks? Also, they took away, you You don't have to pay to gamble, which I understand why they did that. Require instructions? Nah. So. Oh, ah, you lose another game, sir. As you wish. So this you have to win a hundred times. I don't know if you have to win it a hundred times in a row though. You have to win a hundred times. Just a hundred times. A hundred times. Can we win this a hundred times? Hello Mario. I run this casino. Ooh, enjoy the food. Feel free to enjoy yourself. I wonder what became of Booster's search for a bride. Business is so slow. Yeah, because you hid your fucking casino in the middle of nowhere. Hey, Mario, want to play Look the Other Way with me? Ready and look the other. Wait. Oh, you didn't get caught. I lost this round. Here, you have this. Want to try it again? We have to win a hundred times. That's two. I am going to do this on my own time. How about that? I'll do this on my own time and then we'll, cause you get a good prize for doing it a hundred times. I actually don't get how it works. Oh, it's just, um, I actually don't think that's that great of an item for a late game. Oh well, you get an item for, for ringing his bell a hundred times. Okay, what other secrets? Oh, I know a secret. And by no, I mean read about it. Oh my goodness. Did y'all hear that? Look at this, like, look at this boy. He's being fucking ridiculous. He's so needy tonight. Oh, and he's gone again. Well then. Well then. Uh, right, okay. Now hold on. In After Megalax is eat, beaten in Bean Valley, grab the seed from the note. I don't know what that means. Grab the bean from the note. Do I have a bean? I have a seed. Okay, yes. So I have the I have the bean. It's a seed. In Nimbus Land, so hold on. Bum ba da ba dum ba dum. Now you tell me how you would find this secret. Okay, you ready? I watched a video about this. You tell me how you'd find this. Oh, there it is. Not a glitch, not a hack. 
There's no visible indication that this tile is any different than any of these other tiles. I know it's not tiles on the Super Nintendo, but, or on the <laughs> fucking, on the Switch, but you get the idea. So here we are now in space. Oh, oh, busted. What to do? What to do? I'll give you this fertilizer if you let me go, okay? So I caught, oh, oh, what happened to my camera? I think my cat messed with my camera. Hold on. Oh boy. Just stumble across it literally. What the heck? Hold on. Here we go. There we go. So now we got we we found this guy and he gave us a pile of shit. Thanks, bud. Oh, he was going to look at the camera. Um, so, we have a seed and we have a pile of fertilizer. Gee, I wonder what we can do. They're coming for me. I'm sorry, y'all. I tried to... <laughs> I tried to keep it together as long as I could. So now we have to go back to Rose Town. This is so... How do you do this without a guide? How do you do this without a guide? So now we're in Rose Town. The music's bopping. Hey, there's a new path that opened up here for some reason. Now we can get back here and there's a water pump and this house that we can get into an abnormal way. So why would we even bother? Oh, oh, come on. Don't tease me. I want to go down the hole. Hello, old man. Hi, I'm the gardener. See that huge planter? I've spent many years searching the legendary seed and fertilizer to fill it with, but no luck. Eh, <clears throat> if I could only find them. Oh, incredible! I do believe that's a legendary fast growing seed. I'll never forget the day 50 years ago I found a book about an enormous plant. It seized my imagination and changed my life. I was about a youth that day that one day I would like to make my plant down. I traveled all over, searching for the out libraries to get the idea, but without the seed to stop, nothing was any use. Just to say the seed is crucial. That's why it's the almost impossible to me that any protest you have really. Oh no. Hey. I haven't finished yet. No. Well, that's my story. Say, will you give me that seed? If you stop talking, I'll give you anything. Okay. I finally have it. This is extraordinary. I can't believe it. That's the quick acting fertilizer I've been seeking forever. I thought it was merely a murmur of the beetles. I searched high and low the world for it. I am a cring pulse of ending. Even though three years ago I thought I became a boost of the past, I made it clean with the beetles. I'm kind of being valley, but both times I heard of the thrill. There was a dash. I just said formulated myself, but that would seem to be impossible. It's no exaggeration to say that I need that formulation for a hundred of course. I just really kind of stress the paramount importance. Really? Oh. Good night. Short attention span. Hmm. You talk it too fast. Yes, you might say I have fertilizer on the brain and diarrhea of the mouth. <laughs> Will you give it to me? Yes, please. Oh, thank you. I finally have both the seed and the fertilizer. I have something to say, but I won't say it. I'll try them out right away. Doop, doop, doop. I'll plant the seed. Doop, doop, doop. And then give it fertilizer. Hmm. Nothing's happening. Oh. Oh! Whoa! Oh, whoa, 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 Wow! This is amazing! Finally, my lifelong dream has become reality. If I were to attempt to describe my things right now, I would be like winning the lottery with the answer a million one against you and all the side with nothing but names of my private charge with the discovery that we have to do my business. I'm saying it's a good one. There's no one who says the old one. I can't just keep it around. There's no one who's going to leave on a plane, pick it up to see if it's just. You know, I see this many different plans. I'm almost getting around and have a truly incredible nature can be. It's acting through. It's going to be a garden. Wait till my buddy's over at Gabby Garden. I'm roughly here about this. They'll be positively green. Oh, do you think it could use a little more fertilizer? Oh. Hmm, maybe not, huh? No! I don't like you! This will get me in Happy Gardener Monthly Magazine. I see someone has entered the chat. 
Who could it be? It might be someone. When I have my soundboard, I'll be able to just... I'll have different, I'll have a whole row of just... Because then I can use them, you know, if I ever get fucking embarrassed. And then I can, I can play them all and they can overlap each other and I can go like, it, 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 It's fucking embarrassing, you know. Remix. That's just a tease of what's to come. Dragon Ball Fighters! Who's your favorite Dragon Ball fighter, Gary? Okay, I go up. Here I go. I just found this secret bean stalk. Oh, it goes to, okay. Broly? I'm sorry, Gary, you've been demodded. More like Gary Dust Scrub. Fucking Broly, bro, get out of here. Yeah, Broly, that's right. I got the lazy shell. I'm just kidding, Gary. Mostly. Oh, it's a clothes. Oh, it's a defense. Oh. It's a to make you a tank. It, it takes away your attack and your speed and your magic attack? Oh, that's rough. That's really rough that it takes away magic attack too. So, like, can Peach wear that? Oh, she can. That's kind of good for Peach, maybe. Oh. Oh, my, my headphones. Why don't I like Broly? Um, honestly, it's, 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 not, I don't like the Broly movies, that's why I don't like Broly. Because, like, okay, you take, take, like, quick, Quick TEDx talk about Broly real quick, because Gary asked. Oops. Just a quick one. Just a quick one. Um, tension. Okay. Krillin is uh, Goku's rival, and he wants to be a better martial artist than him, and then accepts that Goku's stronger and decides to join him on his journey. Uh, Yamcha tries to steal from Goku and also has a crush on Bulma, but then Goku kicks his ass, and he joins Goku on his journey. Uh, Ten Shinhan... Um, is sort of brainwashed by his um, master into disliking Goku and thinking that he's like evil um, and then they fight Piccolo is the demon king of all evil and he wants to destroy the world and Goku goes wait I live on this world um, Raditz is Goku's brother it's pretty good motivation and then Vegeta is the prince of all Saiyans and you know wants to come to earth because Goku Kakarot is a surviving Saiyan and he either wants to bring them to his side or kill him. Frieza is like the ultimate evil of the universe and imprisoned, Go like enslaved Goku's race. Broly? Broly, Gary, as you damn well know, got mad at Goku when they were babies because Kakarot cried a lot as a baby. And because of that, Broly wants to kill Kakarot as full-grown adults. That's Broly. Hmm. Which is the one where the Goten and Trunks win by peeing on him? Is that the second one or the third one? Yeah, I don't like the Broly movies. The babies, yeah, the babies are playing. They're zooming around. I watched all the Dragon Ball Z movies, like, in 2017. Most of them are bad, including the Broly movies. I got the lazy shell. Oh, I got two of them. Ooh. I really should give one to Peach, I think. It lowers her speed, too. But I feel like that's okay. Okay, I'm checking the list of secrets now. Did the original game only have one lazy shell? Do I have the safety badge?
I do, but I don't have the safety ring, I don't think. What is the safety badge? Oh, it prevents status effects, okay. I want the safety ring, hold on. Uh, dabble doobble dabble doo ba bow. Got up to grab my foot. Oh, did they crunch? In the room with the blooper and his kid bloopers. How am I supposed to fucking, what kind of guy is this? Get Mallow out of here. I'm leaving this room. Very bad at this all of a sudden. Will this even be good grinding for me? Let's see, you can sell the bright card, but I don't really want to do that. So I want to, um, off stream, I'm going to try doing the super jump, and I'm going to try doing the 100, um, the 100 lookaways, because, like, that's not something anyone would be interested, I think, in watching on stream. Oh yeah, there's the forest mage. Okay, I want to do the forest mage, too. The forest maze. No crunch, but still hurt. Okay, well, at least it didn't crunch. That's a crunchulation. Crunchulation. What? Now, how am I supposed to know what the room with the squid kids is, huh? When in and out. Oh yeah, and I'm supposed to sleep. Blooper and his kid bloopers go underwater. Dexter, I haven't watched, you haven't watched Dragon Ball Z. I played Dragon Ball Budokai Tenkaichi 3 and thought, bro, oh, okay. Well, then you're, Gary. <laughs> then my retort is this, Broly's fucking OP in Tenkaichi. It's like Broly and like, um, Omega Shenron in that game. <laughs> and Omega Shenron is not in Fighters. Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3. Oh, you said Tenkaichi 3. Okay. Budokai 3 has no balance. Tenkaichi 3, I don't know as much. Have you played Dragon Ball Z Universe, Gary? Because that one's like the Tenkaichi games. These are not good things to grind with, I don't think. Well, I respect you liking Broly based on his his buffness alone. They did make a Broly movie a couple years ago that I still haven't seen. Um, and that might have been good. Fuck, where do I... Go underwater. Oh, hi. Avast, Mario. I've been waiting to see your mug around here again. Ever since our little duel, I felt a whirlpool in my heart, sucking all the joy away. <laughs> this can't go on, matey. Who's Johnny without a fire in his belly? I don't want to fight you again, bro. I'm not ready. And he wants to fight without items? No thanks, bro. I suppose you do have a corker of a fight with that smithy creature ahead of you. Come again! If you find your courage, I'll wait as long as it takes. Okay, so we can't go in there. I want to find where this squid room is. Okay. You're a squid room. You're a kid room. You're a squid. You're a kid. You're a squid. You're a kid. You're a squid room. Behind this pile of barrels somehow. Ah. Ah. You're a kid and a squid. Guards against mortal blows. Ooh. That brings down Bowser's power, but it makes one character KO proof. Hmm. Hmm. What is Booster's Charm good for anyway? Ooh, what kind of pizza? I feel like Booster's Charm has a secondary effect and I don't know what it is. 
Booster's Charm. It has damage taken from elemental attacks. Actually, that's pretty good. Um, okay, more secrets. Oh, right, the forest maze. Okay. Oh, frozen pepper. Okay, well, frozen pizza still can be pretty good. Especially, I think Red Baron pizzas are pretty freaking good. My mouth's watering. I haven't had pizza in freaking five ever. Okay. Forest maze entrance. Here's a secret. Head onto the part where the path splits four ways. Okay, so apparently you can jump on these forever and get a frog coin eventually, but I'm really bad at it. Clearly. I watched a YouTube video that said Bowser and Gino are the worst characters, so that's, I use them all the time. <laughs> Aren't I good at video games? Uh, okay, hold on. Also, is there a way to check? Yeah, um, no. There's a way to check. Yeah, okay, 24 out of 39 hidden treasures. My most active ally is Mallow! Fuck yeah, baby! Question marks, okay. I have a, a Goomba Thump record, which is great. Everything. How come I don't have a gold star in Beatlemania? I have fucking 20,000. Are you joking? I played Xenoverse 2. I like Xenoverse 2. Where's this block? It's right there. I have to get to where the... Um, the path splits in four. I think some of these also have secret blocks. Let me check. Have you played any of those, Gary, besides fighters? <laughs> fighters really came out at the perfect time because uh, Marvel vs. Capcom had fucked up, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's look who that is, Gary. Have you seen this enemy yet? <laughs> Let's peek at its thoughts real quick. This enemy's called Gorilla. I am a work of fiction. Any resemblance to pre-existing apes is purely coincidental. So they're finally here. Uh oh. Has anybody noticed that the music kicks off after you get a five chain? It adds um, some instrumentation. I haven't seen a lot of people online comment on that. I haven't seen anyone online comment on that, actually. Hello, local mama. It's so good to see you. I saw you tweeting earlier. How are you doing? What's with BDSM Donkey Kong? It's not Donkey Kong. I just read the thing. He's his, He may have resemblance, but he's not Donkey Kong. His name's Gorilla, and he's evil. He's an enemy. As to why he's BDSM, that's just like a... That's just an RPG enemy trope thing. There's enemies in Dragon Quest that look like that. It's freaking... There he is! Grillilla. I lost my combo and the music broke out, see? I really want to get back to streaming. Yeah! Would love to see you! Y'all make sure you check out Local Mama. Leave the notifications on. I've been doing great. The streams have been going well. I just um, crossed 500 followers recently. So we're doing a subathon soon. Next week, next Tuesday. I have to take off work. I really want to find this hidden treasure. They announced Budokai Tenkaichi 4? When did they announce that? Um, I don't want Gino or Mallow. Sorry, Mallow. This enemy's even called an Octolot. Like they seem they're like they're meant to be Octoroks. Thank you. Oh, and Bowser leveled up. Roar! I'm the best. Bowser doesn't have a lot of magic, honestly. Just make you think Bowser tank.
Like... <laughs> I have no idea. This one? Oh, I found it. <laughs> That's actually not what I'm hunting for, but I figure since I'm here, may as well do it. Then we'll do Culex. A lot of people want to see Culex, I bet. Try to beat him. Try to beat him once. Has life been going well for you, local mama? How's everybody doing? Anybody go to the movies recently? I saw Beyonce Renaissance with my partner over the weekend. That was a great experience. We saw it think I'm I don't like going to crowded movie showings, not because I don't like crowds, but because I don't like being in crowds since March 2020. So um, thankfully it was a, a smaller showing. We went to a Friday matinee, both took time off work. Uh, bad luck! I've done so much in the last year, I should just do a stream with an update. Yeah, that'd be great. Life stream. Yeah, I like, I used to like seeing movies with big crowds, like seeing Black Panther with a big crowd and like Avengers with big crowds. I used to love that shit, but it's not the same anymore. And I've seen the videos of like people seeing Renaissance with a big crowd and like everybody dancing and singing and stuff. And that's great for them. Um, you can, you can keep that away from me. Thank you very much. I like six feet. Six feet in the movie theater. I don't care. Please and thank you. Where is where I'm looking for? This guide I looked at was just like, when you get to the part where... This game is only on the Switch. Yes. Well, there's a Super Nintendo version. If you have a Super Nintendo or a way to play Super Nintendo games, okay, this is where we want to go. So, we want to go left, left, straight, and right. Okay, I hope this is right. I have a Switch Lite, but would know how to stream it. I use an Aver Media. I use an Aver Media Live Gamer Mini. Uh, I got it on sale a couple years ago, and I like it a lot. Um, sometimes I have to unplug it and plug it back in to get it to work, but that's basically the only... Pr and, and setting up the audio was a little something, because it depends on, on how you want to have your audio set up. But overall, it was pretty easy to set up. Wait, this is just like he random healing items and a frog coin. What a good secret! <laughs> okay. All right. Oh yeah, what's the beetle box for? Hold on, because I feel like there's another thing um, that I haven't used it for. The beetle box is a special item in Super Mario RPG. Mario can catch and store beetles caught in the beetle race on Booster Hill. Oh, and then you can sell beetles. Huh. Let's go do that one time. <laughs> the Beatles. John, Paul, Ringo, and the, the other guy who played guitar. Booster Hill. I want to be... Okay. Oh, right. This is the, this is the butt, the butt touch game, right? Ready for the beetle race? Do you need instructions? You can only move left or right and jump. You can't go forward or backward. Touch the snifsters or any of the barrels and you'll fall back. Now why isn't Donkey Kong on this game? Jump on the barrels or snifters to butch forward. The butt. I think I, I, it's not butt touch. It's, I was making a joke when I played this mini game. I'm trying to remember what it was. Use the snifters or the barrels to move ahead and catch beetles. Oh, it was peach touch. Cause it was, you had to touch peach, but now it's, it's touch beetle. It's the beetle touch game. 
Just like girls used to play in the 1960s. The Beetle Touch game. Oh, I'm bad at this. I'm bad at the Beetle Touch. Because you have to jump on the barrel. Oh, come on. I earned that Beetle Touch. One, t one Beetle Touch. Crap. Okay. Get that Beetle Touch. Two Beetle Touch. Three Beetle Touch evens. I want that Beetle Touch. Oh, butts. Not the, not the butt touch, though. That would be good. I don't know if the red barrel is good or bad. Red seems bad, right? Oh no, my, my sniff it touch. Beetle touch. How many is that, five? Uh, Mario's running. Uh, I think I might be at five. I think I might cap out at five. Yeah, rest in peace, my beetle touches. The Santa Peach butts. Congratulations, you caught five beetles. One female and, wait, four female, one male, and zero gold. I saw the gold one. This makes me sad. Um. Oh, and then I have to go to Seaside Town to get them appraised by the beetle box buddy I hear there's a strange shop in this town that's looking for beetles let's actually check the shops before I know where the beetle shop is I don't need any of this armor though please and thank you or weapons please and thank you yeah I want item items. Health food store. Okay, I have max of everything. Pick-me-ups are so cheap. They're like Phoenix Downs, and they're so cheap. Phoenix is down. You have any mushrooms? Hey, far out. Nom, nom, nom. That was just a regular mushroom. Thanks for the snack. Okay, bud. Well, anyway, beetle store time. This is like a strip mall. Sorry, I need to take allergy medicine. My cat's have been rubbing up all on me. I didn't take allergy medicine. That's my mistake. Welcome to Beetles R Us. Good job. You made 54 coins. Good doing business with you. Okay, so you play the beetle mini game and you get coins. There's an easier way to get coins in this game, but it's fun. Meow. That blue collar look is so dated. Well, fuck you too. Bye bye. Okay, other secrets. I think it's Culex time. After after two hours, I think it's time to go fight Culex. There's the ants, the fireworks, the casino, which I'm gonna do. Yeah, I think I did all the secrets. Oh, I wanna show something real quick. Cause this I didn't notice actually when I played the game. So I wanna go to Booster's Tower real quick just to show something. Since we got some Final Fantasy fans in here. I wanna ask if y'all recognize something cause I clearly didn't. Y'all know what this is over here? At the desk, not not this circuit board, the other thing, this thing. Y'all know what this thing is? Um, I want a Great Dane dog. Is that Scooby-Doo? Is Scooby-Doo a Great Dane? I love larger dogs because they are more gentle compared to smaller dogs, although my cousin has a Wheaton Terrier. I'm not familiar with those either. I like Shih Tzus though, they're very cute. The B is for Booster. There's a circuit board here because this is where the um, desk manager sits. And this right here that Mario's standing behind is... Actually, I'll get a picture of it. I'll show y'all what it is.
I'll show you. Smaller dogs aren't more aggressive. People just don't train them properly. I remember, so I will say, it's not about aggressive, but when my grandma's um, Shih Tzu was teething, I know generally when puppies are teething, but man, that thing was fucking vicious when it was teething specifically. Okay, y'all, check this out. You recognize it now? How about now? That's right. It's Magitek armor from Final Fantasy VI. It's literally, if, if I wonder if I can flip it. Because if, if it were to flip horizontally, I could overlay it perfectly. Transform. Flip horizontal. Yeah, so look at this. Just scale it down. And put it on the desk. And there you go. Oh, well. <laughs> Doesn't stay in the same place, does it? Yep. It's Magitek armor. Literally the same. So there you go. A little Easter egg for the Final Fantasy fans. Speaking of Easter eggs for the Final Fantasy fans. Good transition there. So I heard you like Final Fantasy. Also... Every time I hear this music, I think about do 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 do. So, hold on. I want you to hear what it makes me think of. So, it makes me think about this. Every time I hear those first early notes, I think it's gonna go to, to that. Hello, Franny, how are you? Let me make sure I have all the items I need. Hold on. <laughs> Before I fight. <laughs> Excuse me. Before I go do Final Fantasy reference, let's make sure I'm dripped out. Okay. We gotta go to Mario's pad. That's the menu music from Super Mario Brothers 3. Bet you didn't notice that. Because you were too busy focusing on... Bump, bump, bump. And then again, come do the Mario all together now. Do, 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 do. Ba -da -dun -da -da -da, just like that. Okay, tadpole time. And then we're gonna go fight the boss. <laughs> just gotta make sure. Well, I'm in the front going in Blue Room. I don't need these. I want these though. Yep. And these. Great. Now we're stocked up. I feel like I'm missing something. Wasn't there... I feel like there was another place that sells frog coin stuff, but I can't remember where, so... We're not gonna go there. Where we are gonna go, because I went to the map for some reason... Is Monstro Town. I think... We're gonna go to Monstro Town, yay! 
I still have those episodes on VHS? Episodes of what? I don't remember what I was talking about already. Okay, let's go save, right. Do 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 do. She composed this first though. This was before Kingdom Hearts, so Kingdom Hearts ripped this off. Not the other way around. Okay, here we go. I love this. You have returned to accept my challenge. Okay, let's play here. I want to play the the Culex, um, just so people can see, because I I did do it before. So I wonder if oh man. Can I see the first one? Oh no, I'm getting ads on YouTube. What's happening? I shouldn't be getting ads on YouTube. That's illegal. Okay, yes, I can show you. Okay, great. So it shows, yeah. Oh, I was singing. I had that on DVD. Um, I didn't have it. I rented it. So hold on. So this is what happens when you encounter him the first time. Greetings. I am Culex, Dark Knight of Vanda. I have crossed into this dimension to fight for the Dark Mage. You who stand before me, where does your depth come from? Why are you rendered so... three-dimensionally? The evil power that gave me life mapped out this flat plane as my form. You are formed from a power unknown to me. I wish to gain the power of your three-dimensional world. You will enter combat against me. Okay, there you go. We returned to enter combat against he or they. Now will you fight me? Yes. On guard. I'll let you try my Wu Tang. Hey, look, it's that music. Let's just do it. Where's his crystals, yo? Okay, have you ever seen the film Toy Story? To infinity and stuff. I am matter. I am antimatter. I can see your past. I can see your future. I consume time, and I will consume you! There they are! Let's see how this does. Okay, blue is weak to fire. Good to know. Let's get Mallow out here. Blue's weak to fire. Red is weak to ice. I can't keep up with Master Culex anymore. Okay, green uses fucking mushroom move. Fucking okay. I bet in the original, oh shit. Uh, you like had to have Peach equipped, but now you can switch. Oops, I pressed the button at the wrong time. That's okay. Okay, so red is weak to ice. Okay, yellow is weak to lightning. It's weird, but okay. Of course I'd get woken up in the middle of a nice nap. Let's go. Oh, crap. For some reason, wind is using lightning elements. I don't really get that, but that's okay. Boulder can't block. That's great. And then, let's see, wind crystal. Jump, it's weak to jump. 
I defended against that at the wrong time. Can Peach use a goddamn move, please? Is this what I get for giving her terrible speed? Oh, because she's a tank now. Thank you. Peach actually is a fucking tank. Oh my god. Meanwhile, Mario is like a glass cannon, I guess. I gotta fix Mario. Um, Snowy. Yeah, let's go. Oh no, we're all gonna be Mushroom, including Peach. Nope, just kidding. Kenzan. This really is ridiculous. Uh, let's use comeback. And then... Oh, crap, Mallow. Yeah, oh, we need Mallow. We need Mallow. We need Mallow. Sorry. Hey, Mario, do your jumps. I can't see the shadows, so that's super helpful. Can you imagine being in the Final Fantasy world? Can, just for a second, can you imagine being in the Final Fantasy world and then you get transported to another dimension and all of a sudden some guy just starts fucking jumping on you? Oh, I guess Final Fantasy IV actually had those. Never mind. Never mind. Final Fantasy IV literally had jumping attacks. I'm the clown. Fuck. Now, what's this? I think Mal should use Snowy again. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Now, Mario is pretty goddamn useless right now. Um, and he's the only one who's affected by this. So let's use status on Mario. Just so Mario's not, like, super weak all the time. Hey! What's this? Come on. For real? That's evil. And Mario has to Phoenix down Mallow now. Uh, we still need Mallow. So Mario has to Phoenix down Mallow. At least it does a full heal. Mario's now gonna take extra damage, and now Mario's gonna take extra damage. Yeah, we need to have Peach. I'm glad I gave Peach this item. What I should have done, I I'll f I know what to do for Peach later to make her not totally like broken though. Broken as in in a bad way. Um, Snowy. Super fireball. Okay. Worth. 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 Mario goes to therapy. He needs it. Thank you. Why specifically Mallow? Or is it all of them? It's all of them. Now, someone needs to use uh, Royal Syrup. Yep. Where do we get... I need to find where to get Royal Syrup for free. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Nope.
Okay. Once we get down to base Culex, I'll feel better. I might lose anyway, which would be really shitty. But I could fix my equipment and then win. This actually really does feel like a Final Fantasy boss fight though. Like I'm genuinely challenged, which is great. Mario is really weak. Did Scoop beat this? I wanna see Scoop beat this. Oh, this one's funny. One, two, three. Snow time. Snow time like now, right? Snow time like the present. Ah. Come on. Yes! Peach can finally use an attack. I don't know what this does. I've never used it. Peach throws a lot of bombs and it doesn't do a lot of damage particularly, okay. Good to know. There's only, I think there's only one move that does ice damage. Yeah, this feels like it was like the original and I I do know that this guy gets a rematch. That doesn't spoil anything. Every character gets a rematch in this game, including this guy. Um, Mario's just not very good. <laughs> I did, so there's this other feature in the game. I don't know if the remake has this. The more that you use jump, and that's just the basic non-super jump, it actually gets stronger. So if from the beginning of the game, you're using jump with Mario all the time, it caps out at a certain point, but jump will eventually be a really strong move for Mario. I didn't do that. So let's see how strong jump is. It's actually not bad. And I don't know if it goes up after every battle or um, every um, every usage. There we go, pop them. You're really gonna make us all, oh shit. We need Mallow. I need Peach. Um, I need some, I need pick-me-ups. I need a lot of stuff. We need to swap Bowser back out for Peach. Peach needs to heal Mario in therapy. I don't know what Culex is weak to, come to think of it. I guess we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. One, two, three. Let's cross that bridge now. Nothing. I feel a bit out of place. Let's use Super Jump on Earth Crystal. One, two. Wow, garbage. Let's get Geno back. Oh, that move's so hard to dodge. Speaking of hard to dodge. The timing on that is ridiculous. I don't know what Shredder does. Doesn't appear to do anything. Doesn't mean it doesn't do anything though. Um, let's use a... I'm sure I can find more Royal Syrup. And I got a freebie, how nice of that. Okay, Gino. Switch with Peach. At least we got Gino back. Switching characters, and they didn't really, I think, change the balance of the game to adjust for being able to switch characters, because being able to switch characters mid-battle is definitely a game changer. Like, imagine being locked to three characters for this. Okay, here we go. One, two. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
12. Okay, one, two, three. It missed. What's the special with Peach? I don't want that. Hits all enemies. Protects the whole party. I think I want Mario, Gino, and Bowser again. Let's get Gino back. Um, Gino World, oh, it doesn't work against boss enemies anyway. Yeah, so let's just attack normal. Mario's gonna do super jump again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, I stopped counting and that's what happens. I'm switching. Bowser's fucking scared, damn it. I can't use it. Oh yeah, I can. Yeah, let's go. Will it be affected because Bowser's scared? I guess we'll find out. This is my favorite move, if you could tell. I think it actually might have been, which is unfortunate. Well, Mario, Peach, and Bowser. Isn't that what the people want? Dirks. I don't know what Shredder does still. I'm gonna win this. For a little bit it looked rough in there, but I'm gonna win this. I like that there's like a dissonant chord in there. That's great. Wow, is anybody has anybody ever done it like Uematsu? <laughs> I know, I know Shimomura arranged this, but come on. This is great pixel art too. Damn. I thought they might redo it in the Octopath style. Ooh. So Final Fantasy 15 was not the first time Shimomura composed the Final Fantasy victory theme. Oh, I love this. And then we get to see them do their little dance to it. Yes, 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 yes. other dance moves that's oh I love that so much I love that so much Gino let's level you up I never use Gino's magic let's let's get real and they're all gonna dance for peachy yay Gino gets his little shuffle this isn't the first time Gino's heard that song I bet magic, I suppose. Yeah, because it still does her magic defense. Oh, here we go. Oh. <gasps> ah! Oh, I didn't, I didn't know all these songs played. stare at Mario's butt for a little bit. Oh, it doesn't go, okay. Okay, fine. 
I thought we might get the whole thing. That's okay. With the... With the strings and everything, that's okay. It's probably a short loop. Ah, your spirit is strong. This legendary strength is the power of that third dimension. It is far mightier than the forces of malevolence could dream. I will treasure this memento of my journey here. Perhaps in another time. Another game. Another... Fantasy. We may have been mortal enemies. Someday, I will gain the power of this third dimension. And those forces will visit a land not yet mapped. Until that time, take this. Treasure it as a keepsake of our fight. Yay! I got the thingy. Farewell, Champion Knight. I'm... I must go. My planet needs me. Okay. Goodbye. Oh. His house is gone. Hmm. Okay. I wonder what they have to say next door now. I heard your record for jumping. Oh. Speaking of jumping... Forgot about this. I don't know where this key goes. I read about this, too. I think our neighbor moved away. There you go. I got the temple key. So what does that do? Oh, yeah. I should check, um... Before I forget. So what's the quartz charm do? Because it doesn't tell you. It halves damage taken from enemy attacks and adds 50% to more, more to attacks the wearer performs, and it prevents against mortal blows. Uh, yeah, I think Mario's gonna wear that from now. Oh, but use jump. Mario's gonna wear that from now on. That fixes Mario. Now, do we want to give... Now, I thought we had two lazy shells. Huh. Well, that's weird. I thought we had two lazy shells. Huh. Okay, well, Peach can wear it. That's fine. Yeah. Honestly, Mallow's kind of getting the short end of the deal here. Let's give Mallow the safety ring. Eh. No, I like the feather on Mallow. What's the ghost metal do? Doubles defense during battle. Okay, that's actually already good, but I think it does something else too. It has damage taken from all attacks that deal numeric amounts of damage. Okay. So now we should honestly be good for those boss battles. But you know what I'll do f first? Let's look at the monster list. This isn't what I mean to do. I just want to look at it. See how many I have left. What's he got? He's Octolot. So I have quite a few that haven't been checklisted. Oh, I didn't do the Pulsars? Oh, I've checklisted a fair amount of them. Wait, I didn't get... Oh, because I fought those. That's why. Oh, there's another Jinx I didn't do. So I've gotten a fair amount of these. Nice. I'll get these. I'll clear this on my own time. Oh, all the machine-made Axums? Are you for real? Because the Axums don't even have... Th oh, they do have thoughts. Oh. Uh... <laughs> That's funny. I'll read through that later. That's a good... Games are great when they have bestiaries. Uh, where did I want to go? 
Not Moleville. Or not, um... Shoot, where did I want to go? They have thoughts. They all have thoughts, and you can peek at them. Where the fuck did I want to go? Man, shoot. Oh, the temple key. Mario can get past the living golden statue of Bellamy guarding the treasure room in Bellamy Temple. I don't want to fight Bellamy right now, though. Oh, crap. Blech, my throat is scratchy. I did this cutscene already. <laughs> did it together. You're right. I'm tougher than last time. We beat him twice and we can do it again. Oh, we're fighting Bellamy now. We're fighting Bellamy again. Again. If you want to see the, the voices for that scene, go back to the VOD and go to about the 30 minute mark. And you'll find it. Uh, let's get Mallow out here. Time to peek at thoughts! Wow. Lightning, fear, poison, and mute. Okay. My throat's so scratchy. Life would be better if it wasn't. I can't switch back to Bowser this turn, so let's use Geno. And now it's gonna put us all to sleep. And that's okay. Oh, just Mallow. Okay. Now I can switch back to Bowser and give him poison. Fart time. I say that every time, but really it's because it reminds me of a fart cloud. What do you want me to do about it? Uh, super jump again. With the taste of your lips on the right, you're toxic, gossip, and under. Uh, I kind of want to keep Mallow out, honestly. This clone will protect me. You all look delicious, but how do you taste? I forgot about that. Eh, sour. There we are. What? I'm awake. I kill you. Okay. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to jump on Bellamy, damn it. It's shielded. Yeah. Mallow, wake up. Uh, Britney Spears and you have the same birthday. That's one of my favorite Britney Spears songs, if not my very favorite. What is your favorite Britney Spears song? Are you fucking... I jump on Mario. Now, why is Mario resistant? Yeah, what the hell? I thought Mario was weak to Mario jumps. Mallow needs to wake up. Oh, we're in trouble. Toxic is up there. Did I not use the wake up juice on Mallow? Oh, I think they put Mallow right back to sleep. Thanks. Okay, enough of this. Um. Oh, Mallow has. Uh, Gino has summer did. Gino Flash! <laughs> Gino Flash! You're welcome! Yay! Toxic, yeah. All going to sleep. Great. Get Bowser back out here. Bowser smacks Bowser. Switch to Peach to wake Mario up. Oh. 
You can't eat me again. I mean, I guess you can. Because you did it. But I don't like it. Ugh. There we go. We popped Bowser clone. Get Mallow back out here so Peach can wake Mallow up. Thank you. Don't eat Mallow. Okay, good. Maybe Mario's weak to fire. That might be what Mario's weak to. We could find out. Or. Um. I'm slapping Mario. Oh wow, Peach is not an attacker anymore. Okay. Peach is support character only. Um, no, he's resistant to fire. Got it. Okay, now we need Gino back, please. Even though Gino's asleep. Now Gino's dead, and we're both asleep. Ugh. He's gonna eat one of us. Okay, so Gino's here, and Gino can attack. Hey, it's me, Gino! Way forget about it. Baby. Come on, forget about it. Just, just forget about it, though. Ugh, Bowser's asleep too. Fucking goddamn it! Therapy. Thank you. Oh my gourds! And that's gonna eat Gino. Great. This is just like tedious. It's not even like, this is one of those square boss battles where it's not even hard, it's just tedious. Okay, Gino, fight your Gino clone. Let's get Milo to scan the Gino clone so we can find out what it's actually weak to. Fire, cause it's, yep, a clone. Or, cause it's fire. Or it's made of wood, jeez, that's what I'm trying to say, cause it's made of wood. Great. No, we need to switch to Bowser, who is asleep. And now we're all gonna go to sleep. Item, party cleanse. Now I need Mala to be able to switch with Gino so that we can finally do this. To infinity. And beyond. Goodbye. Oh boy, you're not weak at all. But now we're strong. Uh. Okay, let's use. Oh, we can terrorize it. Um. Yeah, let's actually do that. Miss. Oh boy. Mallow can probably do something. Okay. That counts as something. Moi, I'm Peach. Bonk! Oh my god! Oh, I missed her thought. Okay, fire. Okay. Well, get Gino out here. Okay. Now, why Aurora Borealis? 
Now we're all asleep. Again. Okay, Peach can use Groove Hug. Everybody's healed. Yay. Now Mario is gonna use nothing because these are all bad. Let's just jump. Try jumping. That's a neat trick. Now, one thing I don't understand about the super jump is whether after it starts playing the life chime, if I'm doing any more damage. Oh, I can do shocker, right. Okay. I can keep doing shocker. I mess that up. Peach can put Mario in therapy. These final boss battles are really just like. Now fucking Mario gets. I don't even know what I'm. See, I, those aren't even words really anymore. Swap Peach out for um someone. Yeah. Pop. But now if Bowser faints, look at this, we get Peach back out. We just come back on Bowser. It's a, it's a war of attrition, really. Mario gets bonked, see? Oh, Mario's somehow still asleep. I'm doing play-by-play -play now, folks. I'm doing sports. Oh, come on! Peach is weak to fire somehow, which I'm not really having a lot of understanding of. Oh, and of course she can also heal, just like our Peach. Oh boy. Can this wake us up maybe at least? That'd be great. No. Well, okay. Mario gets come back. Mario has restored to life. And now Mallow gets mommed. Mommed? Nommed even. Yeah, ugh. Okay, Mallow's awake. Mallow's awake to do damage. They both resist lightning now. What is Melal weak to? I don't know. We don't get to find out. And now we're all asleep again. Uh, group hug. This is why you need Peach. It's gonna put Mallow to sleep, but just watch. Okay, maybe not. I'm pretty happy about that, actually. Okay, Mallow clone is down. So now we can shock her. Okay. We'll do group hug again. Yeah. Okay, great. I really don't, at this point, know <laughs> what's effective against Bellamy, but I do know... This is the last boss battle I'm doing, because I wanted to go to where the temple key is. I'm taking too many hits. Uh, I don't feel good, but I'm better. Almost scratchy throat, except this is what my voice sounds like. Time for Bellamy to say bye-bye. Boing. It's lasagna time. Not even that much XP or coins, but we seem to have gotten an item. Looks like Bellamy spit something up. What is this thing? Oh! This stick might have been my grandpa's! What? How can you tell? 
because he once told me that he lost it around here somewhere. <sighs> well, that makes it yours, right? You're the spell slinger of the team, so if anyone can use that thing, it's you. Yay! A special item for me! Grandpa, I'll take this stick you left behind and put it to good use. Remember to equip it. Oh, yeah. Now, I gotta find where this temple entrance is. There's supposedly... I thought I got this already. Isn't it like right here? Yeah. Okay, here's another place where we probably already fucking fought Bellame. A lot of Bellame action. Oh yeah, I rolled for another fortune. Um, so that pops you back up to the world though. Huh. Oh, maybe you have to like spawn the Bellame statue specially. Okay, well, let's go one more place. Cause we did, we came full circle actually. And we fought Bellame, which we were doing at the beginning of the stream. So we came all the way around. I wonder if that expert bomb maker ever stopped making bombs. Expert bomb maker, eh? That's who's next, and I don't know. That's Punchinello, right? I don't remember where they are. Well. Just the, just the boss battles. So we did not do Psychonauts this evening. That's okay. I think that's okay. Because I had fun. And I hope you had fun. Let's see who's, who's still online. Oh, it's me. Someone raided into me much earlier. I want to thank that person. Autumn Court Fay. Thank you for being here, Master Blastoise. Thanks for everyone who was here. Everyone who participated. Everyone who was a part of it. Um. Yeah, I might do one more Mario RPG stream because we do have, there's all the post game uh, bosses. That can still be done. So, I'm not streaming tomorrow. Which leaves... I might I might knock... Would, wouldn't it be terrible if I just kept delaying Psychonauts? Kept delaying everything. This is why I don't make a schedule. Because it's like, now what am I going to do, right? Because I want to keep playing this. I want to keep playing it till it's cleared. And I think people have fun with the game. So it's like, what's gonna, you know, what am I gonna do? And then I'm gonna start Final Fantasy X-2 and then there's gonna be a, a subathon. I don't know, I might change my schedule. What do people want? Do people want Psychonauts? Or do they want more Super Mario RPG? That's what I'm gonna ask in Discord and on social media. So if y'all wanna help answer that question, uh, I'm going to be posing it there right after the stream because I'm honestly not sure. Um, I Well, my feeling is I want to play more Super Mario RPG is the truth. And then I have to revise my schedule because then it's like, what am I going to do? You know, what what am I going to do on Thursday? What if I don't? You know. So I might re revise my stream schedule, but I'm pretty sure the subathon is next Tuesday. That I know for sure. And so I'm excited for that. I'm looking forward to that. We're going to make that happen. That's going to be real. I'm going to play guitar. I'm going to play games. People are going to be able to make requests. 
I'm gonna have new emotes. Um, and soon, not for my subathon, but soon I will also have a soundboard. Ooh, how do we like that? I like that. Do, do, do. Let's see who's streaming. What if, hmm, yeah, you know what? What if I did something wild and went into the super, oh wait, actually. Oh, you know what? Yeah. We like this guy. We're gonna raid, we're gonna raid it to uh, someone Gary knows. I don't think Gary's in the stream anymore, but We're gonna raid into uh, someone who Gary is familiar with. And we'll make sure you're all familiar with. We're gonna raid into Brian D. Yeah, so peep the socials for updated schedule, um, Twitter and Discord. Cause I have a schedule posted and of course, now I, I second guess my schedule that I've posted. Because there's more Mario RPG that I wanna do. There's just a little bit more, you know? And I wanna explore it. I wanna experience it. I wanna conquer it. I wanna beat the post game. And I'm not usually a post game type of guy, but I wanna get the post game done. I wanna be challenged and I wanna overcome the challenge. Though I feel like I might've missed a post, but like they're telling me the order to play them in, you know? I'm just following what grandpa says. Anyway, the, uh, we're raiding into Shiny Studios, who is playing... Su or no, we're raiding into Brian D. Sorry, I should shout out Shiny Studios. He's playing Fortnite. Um, <laughs> we're raiding into Brian D. Brian D is playing Super Mario RPG. Brian D is a cool guy. Uh, I'll see y'all around the internet. Thanks, Master Blastoise. Thanks to everyone who chatted. Thanks to everyone who, um, who lurked, who viewed, whatever. No risk for spoilers, because we've seen the game, right? Also, the... Uh, the playthrough's going up on YouTube this week in case you missed it. Have a good night. I'll be streaming on Wednesday. Bye.